Good afternoon, everyone. This is Trudy Dantis at the Synod on Synodality, and I'm in a conversation with Om Rush, a theologian from Australia. Om, thank you for being here. Trudy. We described in a previous video that you've got a very special role here at the Synod, mm -hmm. but I have a couple of special questions for you in part mm -hmm. two. Mm -hmm. So you've briefly described the Synod as a dialogue with God. Mm -hmm. uh, can you explain to our viewers what you mean by that? Uh, the, uh, um, I can only go back to the Second Vatican Council, first of all, to give a simple answer. And the, uh, Vatican II spoke of uh, the Church constantly throughout history dialoguing with God. Right. It's, it talked about the most fundamental Christian reality, and that is encountering our creative God yes. in personal relationship as a, it's a, called it a friendship relationship, and, and that God's outreach to us is always uh, an invitation, yes. and faith is a reply and a response to that. So, um, a human being's relationship with God is always in dialogue with the one who has created us. Yeah. Um, uh, so uh, that's what the church has to do. There's, there's a great um, uh, quote from one of the documents of the Second Vatican Council, De Verbum, on divine revelation yes. and how it's transmitted throughout history. And, and it says um, that the church, um, through, uh, God has spoken in the past, uh, mm -hmm. but God continues to dialogue with the church, and it is the Holy Spirit is who is the interviewer, if you like, That's uh, right. within that dialogue. And and this, the church, the Holy Spirit is the one who uh, who guides the church through history. But we're involved in that. Yes, we have to work it out. Where does the Scripture say talk about? artificial intelligence. Yes. We, we have to work that out according to scripture, past teaching of the church, but that's happening here and God dialogues and wants us to reply uh, in the here and now. A and this is what this synod is doing. Absolutely. Listening yes. to the sense of the faithful in their lives, different contexts, we've got different cultures around this room. Yes. Um, but, and, but together we're trying to help each other to come to answers to the new questions. And this is what conversations in the spirit is. Absolutely. And we're, we're, we're conversing that, with God. Yeah. And, uh, and this is why this, this beautiful prayerful atmosphere that pervades this hall, yes. as, as you well know, um, is, it, it's a big prayer meeting. Yes. We're, we're encountering we're God and that's it. why, uh, yeah, so uh, now, yeah. Okay, well, um, there's one more question. How does this synod fit into the modern history of reform in the church, such as Vatican II? Okay, I think it, it fits in by uh, the very fact that, uh, that Vatican II has highlighted this notion that, that faith is always embedded in history, yeah. in a culture, in a particular circumstance and what the gospel means. For example, you know, the, the, a parable. Often they're enigmatic. What does that mean in the here and now? And um, so, so the church throughout history in Vatican II, I, I think is, um, we're doing here what Vatican II tried to do in the 1960s. Right. You know, 60 years later. The world is such a different place. That's right. You know, yes, we um, uh, we can take videos on on phones and and, and so <laughs> but it's a different world, and there are different issues that um, yes. like questions that never been thought of before. Correct. You know, yes. and in past doctrine, although that's very important, not past doctrinal teaching and on moral issues and yes. past practice, uh, they're helpful, but. You know, from this context in South Sudan or something. You know, what does all this mean? You know. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, and I think this is what we're struggling with here. Can we have diverse interpretations um, throughout the world and still maintain unity in the faith? 
Yes. I so, so it's a big been... task and they're ongoing yeah. questions. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, that's been wonderful listening to you. Thank okay. you for those insights. Thank you. And I'm sure our viewers will appreciate that as well. Yeah, thank you. Um, we've got to get back to work, so we will yeah. farewell our viewers. Thank you for everyone watching. This is Trudy Dantis and Om Rush at the Synod on Synodality.